The Mushroom Kingdom is ordinarily pretty bright and sunny. It looks like it's either spring or summer all the time. However, if you ever wondered what it looks like during the fall, and you happen to own a copy of Super Mario World, you're in luck because there's a way to find out, with a little bit of patience. The first thing you'll want to do is make your way to Star Road. The first access point to Star Road is located through a secret exit in the first ghost house in Donut Plains. Warp there, and you will find five levels centered around Yoshi. However, I don't recommend starting there. To me, it's much easier if you activate the first three switches, which are the yellow switch, the green switch, and the red switch. There's a blue switch in the woods, but it's not really needed. Take the second access point in Star Road inside the vanilla dome, and you will proceed to make your way through the four levels remaining in Star Road. Once you beat the fifth road of Star Road, you will be teleported to Special Road. Special Road is eight levels named after different 90s slang, which are gnarly, tubular, way cool, awesome, groovy, mondo, outrageous, and funky. You'll then be given another star to warp back to the beginning of the game and you'll see that it is now brown. So here is the before. You can see that it is very green and bright. And here is the after. It is now brown and a lighter green. Here is the normal level. This is the first level of the game. So this is what a Koopa shell traditionally looks like. There's a red and green shell there. But after you've beaten Special Road, you'll notice the background is the same, but the shell is no longer a shell. It is actually a Super Mario mask that the Koopas all wear. The hats on the mask match the color of the shell that the Koopa would be. And here is a traditional vine. And here's the vine after the palette swap. You can now see that it looks like a jack-o'-lantern. In the last one, there's a traditional piranha plant. And here is the now jack-o'-lantern piranha plant. Now, one last bonus inside Special Road. If you wait around the overworld map for a minute or two, you'll hear the only instance of the Super Mario theme inside Super Mario World. If you'd like to see a full run through of how this was done, please let me know in the comments. Also feel free to recommend any other game that you'd like to see me try, and feel free to share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching and please subscribe.